When manifesting, you do not condition it in any way. That means do not pay any attention. Don't give any thought to how it's going to happen. This question is asking, uh, should you expect multiple ways of uh, living the experience? No, no. You, If you want something, don't imagine receiving it. Okay, don't imagine any way that it would happen. Just imagine you already have it. Okay, if you want money, you're not going to imagine someone handing you the check. You're going to be holding the check. Okay, you don't want someone giving it to you because then you're going to be looking for who did it. Okay, you don't want to, you know, imagine getting a house uh, and thinking about paying for the house. You're already in the house. Fall asleep in the house. It's already yours. It has been yours. Okay, that way you're not looking for how am I going to get the money for the house? Okay, I could give a ton of examples on this, but you do not imagine how. Do not imagine how. The how is up to God. Okay, and not that that's not you. It's still you, but you don't have to worry about it. That is how divine you are. Your power is so far beyond what you're consciously aware of. You don't have to think about how. The Bible says, I have ways and means ye know not of. You don't need to know how. You just need to know it's done.